recent advancements in the search for an interstellar habitat have been achieved by scientists. The James Webb Space Telescope unexpectedly discovered a new planet bearing striking similarities to Earth, sparking speculation about its potential as an alternative home and the existence of extraterrestrial life. Amidst this excitement, another planet, deemed more favorable for humans than Earth, was uncovered. This video explores the characteristics of these newly found planets, their discovery locations, and the indicators that experts consider conducive for human habitation. Additionally, the likelihood of discovering intelligent life on these planets is pondered, as NASA unveils a planet superior to Earth in terms of habitability, concerns about Earth's sustainability due to issues like global warming and pandemics fuel the quest for a new home. Scientists anticipate an eventual planetary catastrophe and have been exploring cosmic options akin to Earth for human settlement, initially focusing on habitable planets within our solar system. In the mid to late 1900s, scientific curiosity drove efforts to explore planets within our solar system. Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus emerged as potential candidates, excluding Jupiter and Venus due to their proximity to the Sun. Subsequently, it became evident that none of these planets were suitable for human habitations. Jupiter's turbulent weather and atmosphere, Saturn's hydrogen-rich environment with helium rain, and Uranus's lack of oxygen made them inhospitable. Mars, though arid with dust storms and radiation, emerged as the closest viable option. Visionaries like Elon Musk express optimism about transforming Mars for human settlement, and plans for establishing a Martian base are underway. However, replicating Earth-like conditions on Mars, oxygen, gravity, water temperature, air pressure, poses immense challenge just guess and requires substantial financial investment potentially reaching trillions of dollars. To simplify the quest for a viable alternative to Earth, scientists have devised the Earth Similarity Index, which assesses various factors such as temperature and atmospheric pressure to gauge a planet's resemblance to Earth and its potential to support life. This index spans from 0.0, .0 to 1.0, where a higher value indicates greater similarity to our planet. Technological advancements have enabled scientists to explore distant cosmic realms, leading to the identification of promising habitable candidates, including exoplanets and moons bearing resemblances to Earth. An example is Tea Garden B, discovered in 2019, situated approximately 12.4 light years away. This planet, with a mass of 1.5 Earths, orbits around the M type star Tea Garden. Known for its characteristics as a red dwarf star with a temperature below 3,600 Kelvin and a mass one-tenth that of our Sun. However, despite its seemingly cool temperature, the red dwarf star can still generate ample heat for its two planets. T Garden B orbits the star at a distance of 0 0.252 astronomical units, while T Garden C, the only other planet in this solar system, has an orbiting distance of 0.4 astronomical units, completing one orbit in approximately 11 days. Both planets closely resemble Earth's conditions and intriguingly reside in the habitable zone of their star, where liquid water could exist. The habitable zone is the region around a star where the surface of orbiting planets may support liquid water. If a planet is too distant, water freezes, and if it's too close, water evaporates. For example, Neptune, due to its considerable distance from the Sun, is filled with frozen water. Conversely, planets like Venus, which is close to the Sun, lack water even in the atmosphere. Earth, ideally positioned, is not alone in this respect, as evidenced by the discovery of Tea Garden B and C. Tea Garden B appears particularly promising, scoring 0.95 on the Earth Similarity Index, indicating it closely resembles Earth. Despite uncertainties regarding air pressure and temperature, scientists estimate surface temperatures ranging from 0 to 50 degrees Celsius, potentially around 28 degrees Celsius, if the atmosphere resembles Earth. In contrast, Tea Garden C being farther from its star, 
has a higher likelihood of being too cold for habitation, with a mere three chance of a warm surface temperature. Its atmosphere is speculated to be more akin to Mars, with temperatures around 40.7 degrees Celsius. Both planets are tidally locked to their star, leading scientists to project atmospheres with densities 13 to 17 times that of Earth. While there is speculation about these planets potentially serving as a new home in the face of Earth's potential disasters, another intriguing possibility is the existence of extraterrestrial life forms on Tea Garden B and C. The age-old question of whether we are the sole species in the universe has fueled the realms of astronomy and cosmology for centuries. So far, humans haven't found any aliens or planets perfect for extraterrestrial life. Scientists focus on planets with the right conditions, like a good atmosphere and temperature, especially those in the habitable zones with water, considered essential for life. T Garden B and TIE 700 planetary system are notable, with TIE 700 being highly regarded, having four planets, two of which are in the habitable zone. The TIE 700 and I 700 E planets seem promising as they are similar in mass to Earth and have rocky surfaces. T700 E is 95 Earth size with a 28 day orbit, while Ti 700 D is 105 Earth size with a 37 day orbit. The Ti 700 star system, over 1.5 billion years old, is just a bit younger than our solar system. This time span allows for the possibility of life forms evolving. Experts suggest T700 E and 700 D might have a rich biosphere, especially if their atmospheres are warmer than Earth's. Discovering life on these planets could be groundbreaking, possibly resembling Earth's life forms. However, it's all speculation until we find ways to study their atmospheres and surfaces. The vast unknowns of the universe leave much to learn about potential life forms on distant planets. Scientists are exploring the possibility of finding strange and unique forms of life, not only on Earth, but also on distant planets. Life on Earth has shown that organisms can survive in extreme conditions, serving as models for potential extraterrestrial life. Instead of focusing solely on Earth-like planets, scientists consider the idea of life forms different from what we know. There might be extreme biolife in supposedly uninhabitable planets with conditions like high radiation or extreme temperatures. Recently, astronomers discovered hot exoplanets with larger habitable zones, like K218, which has high atmospheric pressures. NASA's Kepler Space Telescope, launched in 2009, played a crucial role in finding such planets, revealing that a significant percentage of stars may host small rocky planets similar in size to Earth. Kepler revealed planets in the abhabitable zones of their stars. One such planet is K218b, 124 light-years away, in Leo. It's a small Neptune-like planet orbiting a dim red dwarf star. Scientists think planets like K218b might support life due to iBiomarker molecules' as traces of organic processes. These molecules can be found in soil, water, or atmospheres, like methyl chloride and dimethyl sulfate. While Earth life is carbon-based, some planets might have oxygen, methane, or hydrogen dominance, leading to potentially different life forms. Planets like K2OD18b challenge our understanding of habitability, suggesting life could exist in extreme conditions. Scientists explore the potential for life beyond what was once considered inhospitable, akin to extremophiles on Earth thriving in extreme environments. The finding of extremophiles has broadened our knowledge about where life can exist. Scientists are now considering the possibility of finding unusual life on distant planets like Venus, which was previously thought to be inhospitable. Recent studies suggest a potentially habitable layer in Venus's upper atmosphere, leading to interest in searching for microbial life there. Moons like Europa and Enceladus, though harsh on the surface, might have life-friendly subsurface oceans. Upcoming missions, like NASA's Europa Clipper, aim to explore these moons for signs of life. 
advancements in technology such as the James Webb Space Telescope will help study distant planets in detail looking for signs of life. The search for extraterrestrial life involves astronomy, planetary science, and astrobiology. Despite exciting discoveries like Tea Garden B and the TIE 700 system, the quest is still in early stages. The vastness of the cosmos and potential for diverse life make the search both challenging and fascinating. Every discovery, whether Earth-like planets or unique life forms, adds to our understanding of the cosmic tapestry and the potential for life beyond Earth.